everyone. Good afternoon. This is Jonna from Plants, Cactus, and Succulents. Today is May 9, 2023, and the weather is so cloudy. It's already 2.30 in the afternoon. Let's see the plants or the cactus. So I'm approaching here. So this one <laughs> keep growing. Look at that. Since I'm gonna repot this and this one, <laughs> this is my first here. She, oh she has a white flower there. And then look at that she built up the I can propagate here but with regards to cactuses I love for them to grow bigger and bigger so I'm gonna repot this I'm gonna repot this they all look I like their their texture <laughs> they have this golden brown tones and this one, she's flowering, flowering with orange. Oh no, sorry guys, it, with pink. <laughs> I'm color blinded. All right, so they are on this, uh, I don't know what size is this. this size of pot. So what I do is I always clean all my pots that I utilize if I had a chance and then set them aside. I, I wash them with warm water and soap and then dry them up and then set them aside. So the next time I need to repot, I have something to use and I don't need to buy new pots anymore. So that's a tip from me based on my experience. Okay, so let's bring them here. Okay, one, and then let's go back. And going back, my begonia flower is saying hi to everyone. <laughs> oh, hello, hello, hello. There's, they're blooming, blooming massively. All right, let's pick up the other one. Just need to be here. Okay. Number two. And let's go back again. This time we look up. And this is my hanging basket over here. I just attended them so they're happy with my care today. <laughs> All right. Oh, come on. Come here. Come here. Come here, baby. <laughs> okay. So it's three now. So one, two, three. I, I do believe this is my first cactus that I took care. And the next is this one. And this one just maybe two months. All right, whatever. <laughs> okay, these are the pots that I'm gonna use, the next size. See that? And this one too. They're old. They're my old, old pots. I, I got them from nursery over here. Even the pots are cracked, still we can utilize them. Recycle, recycle. Oh, hello guys, once again, Joanna. How is everybody doing? It's May 9, 2023. And let's do this reporting. So, I wonder how will I do this? So I have this uh, long tool for set. I got this in Amazon, way, way back. It's thorny. 
this is one of my concern so let's learn so I'm loosening the soil on the side ouch <laughs> protect your hand by wearing a not a plastic or rubber gloves rather a thicker one mine is not yet thicker but because it's hard to, to work anyway it's so thick okay it's losing now okay come on so i wonder if this is six inches pot so this one is eight inches pot This, this uh, pot is already damaged. There is a crack over here, but still I can utilize. So let's recycle. So since the, the pot of the cactus is, let's assume six inches pot. So this one is eight. So it get much more bigger that you can utilize to hold. So you will, you, you will never be pop. I hope. <laughs> and then make sure you have another tools that will help you to push, to manipulate the cactus. Come on. There you can see. So now I'm gonna look at this. that they are white stuff here so I'm gonna spray all right so I have that chapstick here okay. there <laughs> easy huh Okay, I hope you can see better. Let me raise up this one. All right. There. All right, that is much, much better. Any plans for those mom? <laughs> Do you have plans for your mom? So by using the bigger pot, you can manipulate the cactus. And it really, really protect you from any prick. See? Now, there you go. Now, how will I manipulate you? <laughs> so big. <laughs> So I'm holding the the roots over here, and then you will see. So dirty, right? We have we have something to to clean it. Hold on. Get any brush. It's unavoidable because we are doing repotting. Okay, so clean here. Take out some of the soil on the lower portion. See? I, we protect, I protected my hand by using this. So. Spray here. I decided to spray with uh, alcohol a bit, just in case. <laughs> Uh, 
guys so I filled up the soil on the side but I want to show you how did I do it so I have my my tweezer or long borset so use it and push up the cactus gently then if you will see there's a space here that needs soil so I'm gonna pull correction so I'm gonna put more or pour more soil so when it's like that when you pour the soil make sure it doesn't have uh, air pockets so you need more other bigger stick that can push the soil see that so that's my technique that's why i don't have air pocket on my pots so more So your two hands are working. <laughs> so let me tap, tap, tap. Ajinomoto. <laughs> For Philippines, there is Ajinomoto. The Bechin. Okay, so if you will see, there is more space here. Oops. There is more space that needs more soil. So by using another tools like a forcep or stick you can don't touch the cactus just manipulate them with your tools see the the soil <laughs> they're gone okay there you go so guys thank you so much I'm just gonna do one in the camera and these two I'm gonna do off camera I'll try let's see <laughs> let's see I always said that but uh, I ended up doing the tree but let's see maybe this one huh let's see if not the time doesn't permit just this one the same pattern anyway all right thank you always remember god loves you and i love you too okay guys i tried to repot the third pot the third cactus which this one this one and these are the others no wonder it didn't grow much because okay, this is the this one is okay this one is okay i don't know what happened but this one i said why it looks so pale 
then I realize when I try to check it's rotted look at that but uh, the babies are here I took out a few babies one two but the mother passed away <laughs> look at that first time I've seen her a cactus in my garden pass away <laughs> okay the mother passed away okay so I'm gonna all these babies two three okay this one passed away too died sad and this one is still okay so one two three four and there's one more here five so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna repot this over here and the babies I'm gonna put on the side of the other mother this one <laughs> you guys you need to take care of the babies here because their mommy died just to let you know not all plants in my garden, <laughs> you know, turn successful. Sometimes it happens like this. So it's just, uh, it's a learning process. It's a learning moment that I need to share as well to you guys. So what to do if you have like this kind of uh, plants that died, it rotten. Like I feel bad because the uh, one mother died, but the babies one, two, three, four, five babies survived. So let's see. So no wonder they didn't grow much. Anyway, we have uh, one, two, three more, three more mother here that I hope they will recuperate. Very Pass away. This is the month. Bye bye, mother. 